Well, it's starting to cloud up in Dublin, but we're not going to be looking at much in the way of shower and storm activity today. 88 degrees, the current temperature, dew point is 72, making it feel like 94. Here's a look at temperatures across the area. 86, Macon, Warner Robins, 85, Montezuma, 86 down in Americas. But when you factor in the humidity, here's what it feels like outside. 95 already in Warner Robins, 97 in McRae, 94 in Dublin, 93 already in Sandersville, and it's only 17 minutes after 12 on your Thursday afternoon. Live radar is quiet. That's what we expected this afternoon. Not expecting to see much in the way of shower and storm activity. Notice this is through 4 p.m. Only a few green specks on the map. Now, not everybody's going to stay dry. We're still going to see a few showers out there, but the odds of staying dry this afternoon are fairly high. And then there we go into the overnight hours. Perhaps a scattered shower tomorrow morning, waking up in the mid 70s. Then once we get into tomorrow afternoon, some more widespread coverage area of showers and storms with some brief heavy downpours possible and portions of central Georgia that will roll through overnight Friday into Saturday. So you might dodge a shower for football Friday night, but I think again, for the most part, a majority of us will stay dry for football Friday night. And once we get to Saturday morning, so those showers continuing and into Saturday afternoon, again, brief heavy downpours. You know the drill here in summer in central Georgia. That's what we're going to be looking at, at least for the first half of the weekend. Once we get into the second half of the weekend, Notice down towards New Orleans, there's a tropical something down there. We'll talk about that in a second, but focus on central Georgia for now. Some scattered showers on Sunday. Then once we get into the early parts of the week, maybe some tropical rain here in central Georgia associated with whatever that tropical system is, but nothing significant for us in terms of that tropical system. As of now, Tropical Depression 9 is its name, just located to the south and west of Jamaica, and this thing's moving towards the northwest at 13 miles an hour. So here's the forecast track for it now. Watch it as it moves into the Gulf of Mexico. Expected to become a Category 2 hurricane. That's the forecast as of right now with winds of 110 miles an hour by Sunday at 7 a.m. But then notice it turns into Louisiana and weakens fairly rapidly. And this is going to be far enough away from us here in central Georgia to mean essentially that we're not going to see much in the way of impact. So this high pressure that's going to be located off the coast is going to steer this thing up into Louisiana. And again, this thing is already set in place. That's what we call the Bermuda High. It doesn't have much movement to it. So we're fairly confident that the core of the storm is going to head further to our west. And all we're going to see here in central Georgia is just some rain from it as we get into the middle parts of next week. As for the rest of the day today, 94 degrees is going to be the high temperature. And here's your seven day forecast. High temperatures in the 80s Friday and Saturday before we're back into the 90s for the start of next week.